Hello guys, welcome back to Learn by Rahul. And today we are going to discuss about the very, very most important interview questions and answer on scenario-based questions in Artemis and Test Engineering. So guys, nowadays uh, companies are filtering the candidates based on the scenario-based questions, so they can easily track the strengths of the candidate whether they have the good knowledge, uh, practical knowledge or not. So guys, please watch my video up to end so you will get a proper understanding which type of questions they can ask at the real time interview questions guys okay so if you are new in my channel so please subscribe my channel for more videos and updates so guys without wasting time let's get started the first questions uh, guys i will explain whatever the scenario based question then i will explain one by one every questions okay so i will explain the questions uh, in the part wise and I'll explain the answers as well. Okay, so let's get started. The first, a very common question they can ask about uh, tell me about yourself. Okay, and the next, uh, they can ask what is the roles and responsibility of senior automation test engineer. So, every student and the candidates know about it. These are the two common questions. Now, we talk about uh, the scenario more <coughs> questions like the you are working on design framework or you created the framework okay then have you ever got a chance to design framework from a stretch level okay then what is your approach in as automation testing or as automation tester to do the automation testing okay the next is what are the factors to ensure that whether it is automation testing required or not okay the next one if the project I have early release so would you do automation testing the next one is let's suppose you are going to work on automation project so how would you decide what tools needs to be used so guys you can watch this video like you can experience like uh, these are the real time interview questions so they can easily understand and uh, they can understand to you as well have you ever worked or not okay the next one is the if you are team having the different tools and technologies work experience like some work on playwrights some work in selenium some work on apm in automation testing then what tools and technology you would recommend okay the next one is what tool you used for test planning and test cases executions in automation testing the next one is have you ever managed a team member, any team member reporting to you as a senior test engineer? So basically, if you have a good uh, five to eight years experience, so definitely they can ask this type of questions because you have experience now and might be sometimes you have worked as a lead. Okay, so they can ask you what is the role of QA lead. Okay. The next one is let's suppose you limited, uh, you have limited resources to manage to the work and you have less time to complete testing so how would you manage this situation as a QA lead or a senior QA okay the next one is suppose junior QA is not working as expected then how would you handle this situation okay the next one is if he is lacking skills and you have given proper KT knowledge transfer as well then how will you handle this situation okay the next one is have you ever worked on etl testing or api testing so these type of questions uh, they can ask uh, to ensure that uh, are you aware about uh, the market need needs or have you uh, like worked on it or not to ensure that uh, for the future planning from the company's type okay. the next one is what type of tools you have used in ci cd so these are the basic scenario ways they can ask you. So guys, I have explained the scenario based question in the next video. I'll explain one by one everything, every scenario based questions we have discussed about it. So let's meet in the next video. Thank you.